Just talking? Well, what's the show about? About nothing. But uh, speaking of other uh, 90s nostalgia. Ooh, yeah. The uh, the Mighty Ducks are, are having back. A, are quack. back. Quack. Or quack. Quack. Well, actually, that was the, head, the headline on the article was quack, quack, quack. They're back. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, quack, quack, quack. Guess who's back? But uh, I don't know, I'm trying to perfect it. Um, what does it say? Oh yeah, so it's gonna be a mini mini series for Disney Plus. Nice. Um, so they're the doing Mi- some good shit. Yeah. So Mighty Ducks is re- releasing a. I don't know if it's a. They did. They didn't really say if it. I think it's a mini series. And it's they're basically it's the the uh the article that I was reading says the Mighty Ducks series reboot Game Changers will get underway. On Friday, March 26th. So it's coming up pretty soon. Oh, shit. So yeah. they already shot a bunch of Whoa. stuff. Yeah, so they've been working oh, on it. Yeah. Okay. okay. Nice. Um, let's see. The Disney Plus Nostalgia Trip stars Lauren Graham for you uh, Gilmore Girls fans out there. Oh. Um, and Ducks OG Emilio Estevez repri- reprising his role from the 90s film trilogy of the same name. Dude, I'm so glad they got Emilio. That, Emilio! That was, Emilio! <laughs> that so was sick. my... When I first read that they were doing like a reboot type thing, I was like, oh, I wonder if they're going to do like... Is it gonna they be like a, a like one of those reboots where like it's new cast and everything, or is like are they gonna bring some old people? In? Nah, I right. think yeah, they they gotta bring the the original cast back. So I mean, because they think need about to it, sprinkle they, them in. Yeah, they did it with with uh, Cobra Kai, right? Yeah, so yeah. it's like set the and that's set like it success. That's yep. a recipe for nostalgic success. Oh, I yeah. wonder if that's where they got this idea from. I'm like, sure. Like, oh, they saw the success of Cobra Kai. They're like, oh, oh Disney true. has Could tons be. of nostalgic, you know. Bring it back. Property yeah. to go on. Ne- ne- oh next thing you know, you're going to see Angels in the this. Outfield. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, Angels in the Outfield. Oh, Christopher Lloyd. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Sick. He's still alive. Luckily, dude. <laughs> he's got like, him still. He's barely there. Yeah. <laughs> don't just say, don't, <laughs> don't, don't, don't do that. Don't, don't jinx he's it. He's on my death list. You already yeah. said uh, my uh, death list. Betty White. No. <laughs> Betty White. No. Don't dare you. I got Betty White. Betty White. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, the series is going to be interesting because uh, the the ducks, the mighty ducks, are now you know the, the like the dickhead team. Yeah. Okay. And so, so uh, did you see a trailer, or is this just what yes, you read? They do have a trailer. We will link it in the description if you want to check it out. Sick. Um, if you're listening to the audio version, Google. Yep. yep Google it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so the ducks are the like the dickhead team. Um, they kick uh, Lauren Graham's character's son off the team. Okay. And then basically um, Lauren Graham and her son decide to, uh, they're going to create their own team. So they go on search for a coach. Lo and behold, Emilio Estevez. Is available. AKA Coach Bombay is available. And kickstarts this whole whole journey. How are they, damn, this is so good. How are they bringing him back in? That's so crazy. Because he was a lawyer doing community service. In the first like movie, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that was his thing, you know. Like he had to serve some time. According to the trailer, it looks like he's either managing or running or owns a, a, a ski rink or a skating rink, skating rink, yeah. Uh, and uh, so he went from lawyer to. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Hey, we'll see. Maybe he had Did some his tough life times. Fall apart, yeah. <laughs> he had some tough times. Well, wasn't he was a wasn't he an alcoholic? Yeah, that's why he, he was. Yeah, yeah so maybe. maybe. Oh, Ooh, maybe they're gonna take a darker turn on it. Oh man, oh, darker turn. He lost yeah. his fucking. License to his, uh, his bar the, or yeah. the bar his disbarred yeah, disbarred, disbarred. Yeah, yeah, yeah. he's a debarred, <laughs> debarred. Yeah. Roseanne Bard you got all of them oh shit no only Tom Arnold knows what it's like to be Roseanne Bard <laughs> check out full episodes of the Strange Noise podcast on Spotify episodes also available on your favorite podcast platform <laughs>